it's a sprint race, 30 laps, but please reach up there and pull them belts tight one more time. Oh, tonight more than any other night. We're going to do it. Green, green, green flag, green flag. Boogity, 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 boys. Let's go racing. Oh, oh. Wait, the gear. Didn't get up to speed, gets turned around, and we got all kinds of cars spinning. Gary Earnhardt. Oh, they're all sword, all the pieces. It's about 10 cars or a dozen cars. Now, as they came to the green, as they came to the line, something happened with the target number 41 of Casey Mears, and he got totally jacked up by the car that started fourth, Jeremy Mayfield, lifting the rear wheels of Mears' car off the ground. And behind that, everybody ran for cover and could find none. Guys, I, I don't know. I'm trying to count cars. 25 cars started this race. I'm seeing about 13 or 14 that has pulled away with no damage. Matt Yoakum, what happened? Mike, he came on the radio and told Andy Graves and his crew chief, Jimmy Elledge, when I started to go through the gears, it just all came apart. Transmission. But it all came apart all right. Watch 77, Brendan gone, get Spencer, who got Rudd, who then got hit by Sauter. Earnhardt turned around, hit Burton. Got all that? Yeah, and there goes yeah. uh, Morgan Shepard sliding down through there. Yeah, I mean, when you've got 12 and a half rows 41 of 41 comes back and gets... Looks and like the look four down car. here at the bottom. The two fellows who had to go to the tail end of the field for penalties made Mate out. Paid off. <laughs> Imagine that. Now fans are voting. Well, let's have another look here. That's in the middle of the pack. Watch that 41 car. He bounces off the outside wall. Now watch him. He starts going backwards. Spencer sitting down there has no damage. The 41 backed into Spencer and knocked the fire out of his car. There's how it all starts. Yeah, and look at that. He's jacked up off the ground. Turned around. Here comes Rudd into the wall now. This 41 gets turned around again. He's going, he'll go backwards, and then he'll go across the track, and Spencer is sitting down here on the apron. See him up there in the yeah. four car. Now watch this. Oh. Bam. I think Spencer may have already had some minor damage, but that did him in. And as I was saying a while ago, you got 12 and a half rows of cars. Your outside pole sitter has a problem like that. This is the results right here. And you know, I've felt all along, Mike and Larry, that this was going to be one of those nights. And it, it didn't even, we didn't even get 100 yards past the start finish line. Watch the inside row go. Only nine cars will get through this clean. Ricky Rudd is not one of them. That's a hard lick, but we do have the safer barriers installed here now. Now, remember what happened here uh, two years ago? All the, car. all the cars wrecked going into turn one. Could we see backup cars? Well, that's one of the neat things about Stock Car Racing's All-Star Night. You never know exactly what's going to happen next. <laughs>